Well, howdy, everybody. This is John Michael. It's the 32nd uh, Thursday of Ordinary Time. And uh, we have a lot in this little short scripture. First is people say, well, go look over there or go do this or go do that. No, the kingdom of God is in your midst. You know, it's not rocket science to renew the church. It's just not rocket science. It doesn't take a bunch of novel new stuff. We need to sing better. I don't care whether you do Gregorian chant or Eastern chant or contemporary songs or traditional hymns. Sing, worship God. See, sing. We need, we need to hear the word of God in scripture. We hear so much of scripture at every mass. We hear the whole New Testament and a huge chunk of the Old Testament every three years in our Sunday cycle and every year in our daily readings. And then we need to hear the homily, encourage our preachers, preach brothers, preach. Don't just share information. Don't be boring. The Pope says no more boring homilies. Preach, share your faith. Faith stirs up faith. And then we have that personal encounter with Jesus Christ in every Eucharist. We come forward to the greatest altar call that can be given in every Eucharist. So it's not, there's nothing novel or new about this. Just enter in, enter in, enter in. Wow. And then we hear about the second coming. A lot of people say, oh, this is happening, that's happening. Oh, watch the blood moons. Oh, watch this. Oh, the dark night, the three days of darkness. You know, I've heard it forever, ever. Guess what? When Jesus comes, he'll be like lightning that flashes across the sky. You won't have to second guess it. You won't have to try to figure it out. Everybody will know that Jesus has returned. Wow. But we don't know the day or the hour. So be ready to go, and then you'll be ready to stay. Be ready to stay and take responsibility for your actions. Now you're ready to go every day. This could be your last day. Hey, these are great messages. I love you guys. All things are possible with God.